Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Ahlan wa sahlan Four short pieces of advice during this period of lockdown and shutdown Number one our Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam also went through a period of isolation. He was in the cave and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed to him, Iqra' bismi rabbika alladhi khalaq. What was he doing in the cave? Reflecting. And annually our Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam would sit in i'tikaf for the same. To reconnect with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So ya Abdullah, ya Amatullah, use this opportunity bi idhnillahi ta'ala. Number two. Even though we are in a state of difficulty, even though it's a time of uncertainty, brothers and sisters, every type of ni'mah which brings you closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, in reality, it is a ni'mah which is cloaked as a difficulty. It's cloaked as a trial. But the reality is it's a ni'mah if it brings you back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So times of difficulty that bring us back to Allah, then this was for our benefit, walhamdulillah. Number three, Ya Abdullah, Ya Amat Allah, that woe, woe and woe to you, as Nu'man ibn Bashir has stated, that woe to the person that during times of difficulty, when you have an earthquake, when you have difficulty, when there are natural disasters, when there's a pandemic that is moving around, that you still continue sinning morning, evening and night. You are still watching haram, you're still talking haram, you're still doing haram. Woe to you, Allah Musta'an, that all of these signs are here to bring you back to Allah. But you are not taking heed, Allah Musta'an. And lastly, the fourth advice, Ya Abdullah, Ya Amat Allah, is that Subhanallah, that when it comes to these uh, times, yes, we know that we want to give people hope that don't worry, all will be okay, everything will be fine. Allah is Ghafuru Rahim, Allah is full of mercy, all of that is in its place. But rather, we should word it differently we should say that brothers and sisters don't worry all will be okay if we turn to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we reconnect with allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we make tawbah we make a lot of istighfar we are committed to our deen then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will make everything easy for us insha'Allah. That's the better way to word the matter. That turn back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and your affairs will be corrected bi-ithnillahi ta'ala. Hayyakumullah. Assalamu alaykum.